Hey guys, Game Master Cody here, and we're now about to do Aquarium Towers, the last level in the Summer Forced Homeworld. And here we go. As hinted by the first part of this level's name, this world is going to be underwater. Guy's a jerk. <laughs> oh, let's talk to him first. The funny looking guys with the shock sticks have drained all our water. We can't get it back unless someone activates the switches they're guarding. Killed our sheep. <laughs> the shock stick guys are tough. Yesterday they turned Vern, our giant squid, into fried calamari. Oh man, poor guy. <laughs> well, we can just flame them and take them out. Charge them crabs. Watch out for these gems hiding behind there. Don't miss them. Break one of these pots or vases. Alright, we're done here. So we push the button. And now we can swim. There's a super power up. Well, we don't have it yet. We only have three enemies killed. I miss these gems every time. Oh well. And there's another skill point in this level. We can't get it until after we get the super power up anyway, so... So I've got to kill. Take it. You don't want to fall down there or you will die. Pretty, pretty simple. Okay, barge that crab. Barge the other crab. Swim under here. Swim that crab. That crab with some gems. And that's it for now. Next time, we'll have to fill up the whole level with water first, and then we kind of come back and get those gems. Alright. Let's charge through a whole bunch of enemies. Here's money bags again. Hi, Spyro. You must be tougher than you look to get here. All the same, you won't be able to get past the metal sharks up ahead. I suppose I could let you borrow my submarine, though. For a modest fee, of course. Of course you gotta charge a fee. Oh well, it's worth a it. Just go ahead and take it. Is this with you, Spyro. This submarine is 100% shockproof. I guarantee it. Mm. Two of you pass. There's four more. All right. There's another shot stick. Back. The rest of these bases. That bug, she can't do anything else. And before, 
let's go ahead and get these two gems. They were up on the top of the area where you let off on the shark stuff. Last area. And there we go. Our world is wet again. We all want you to have this talisman of Aquaria Towers to remember us by. Super flame power up. Now, first we can either go up there. That leads to another part of the area. Level we can get the three orbs. Or let's go break some sharks first. Charge through here. And while we're at it, let's go ahead and blast the seaweed. Because that's the skill point in this level. Hold triangle, you can zoom in. Keep shooting until they all die. Alright, they're all done. So let's break this apart. Break open that strong box. Alright, we're gonna have to go charge it up again. That's okay. Let's get these gems. What did I tell you about earlier? Go break some more shark subs. So now we're gonna go back through here. Down this tunnel. Keep your distance, but let them have it. Close to those sharks, they'll eat you. Pretty sure you figured that out, but even with gold sparks, you're dead. And let's do a quick run through to make sure that's all the seaweed. I think I'm missing one strand. I think I know where it's at too, so let's just hit this. Any over here? There is not. Don't forget that gym if you did. And around here, I guess there's not. Oh, I thought there was. Oh well, that happens. Now I can just go up and get the rest of them. Hang on, my nose is itching me. There we go. Up to the green tube. And now we're out. There's a couple seaweeds around here. Most of it's around the edge. So just go around the edge and get it. more inside of it, one there, one there, oh no, it's the only two, there we go, but we got all the seaweed and the level, so we got the skill point, let's go ahead and get all the gems now,
broke the 2,000 mark. What's he pointing up for? Ah, oh, there must be gems up here. And there is. And a yellow and a purple. Those are always good to get. There we go, we have all the gems in Aquarius Towers. Now for the three orbs. Talk to Hunter. I've been trying to tame my new pet manta ray, but he just won't obey me. Hey, you're just about the right size to ride on his back. Great. Hop on his back and guide him through each of the rings of bubbles as it appears. And remember, he's brand new, so try not to get him dented or scratched up. Yeah, this one's pretty easy. Just follow the seahorse. I owe you something for that. Here, take this orb. I found it in one of my flippers. Now that the manta ray's tamed, I'd love to get him into racing shape. Care to take him through a harder course? I suppose we could take him through a harder course, Hunter. Let's see. Okay. Good luck! Tougher course. It's not really that difficult, but you know, to sometimes make some tighter turns, pay attention better, that's about all. in my other flipper, too. How's he holding orbs in his flippers, for one thing? You know what? I don't want to know. Let's go talk to that seahorse king we saw earlier. There he is. The water workers have kidnapped six of my children and hidden them in the tops of these numbered towers. I borrowed some explosives to blast the doors off the towers. If you can make it to the top of the six numbered towers, my children will be safe. Alright. So they'll open an order and then they'll show you where they're at, so you just have to pay attention after the first after you save them. Alright, the first one you just gotta pass through that thing. Pretty easy, it cuts off after a while and just charge through. Number two's right outside the door. And here it is. There's two of them this time, but again, really easy. Three is back in the main area. Well, the last four are in the main area, so we'll just go there. Dive down. All there is in here is a crab, so I mean, you don't even have to kill the crab. Just go past him and you'll save him, but I felt like killing the crab anyway. Number four is over here. Charge as fast as you can, or just charge. You'll make it after they all quit. It's still not, not really difficult. Here comes number five in this area. Be 
first met the metal sharks, it's around this corner. So it's not difficult either. Right through the crabs and swim up the gate. Let's get that last crab. Clear out this level of enemies. Now number six in the last area where you got the last button. up through the tunnel. Here's number six. Now this one's a little tricky. You just have to be very careful and just slowly swim up with it because it's constantly moving and you just have to stay in between this thing. You'll see. Just slowly move up. Go too fast or it'll get you. And there you go. You did it. Now we can swim in peace. I heard that you were collecting these orbs. Please take this one. And there we go. Quarry Towers is now completed. I guess that one wasn't fake. See? Well done, Spyro. Now that you have six talismans, this door will open. Okay, Spyro. Jump through that hole in the floor to get down to Crush's dungeon. I'll help you by tossing sheep through the hole if I can catch them. Good luck. See what I mean? Once you get all the talismans, you jump straight here to crush the dungeon. Which will be the next level? Once I, uh, I'll return again. Game Master Cody signing out for now. I'll see y'all next time on Crush's Dungeon.